Does this turn you on, babe? Sometimes, yeah. <laughs> Take a picture of you right now. How are you saying? Mm. Living the dream right there. <laughs> you are. Aww. So lucky. Come here. <laughs> you literally look like Homer Simpson now. <laughs> I'm Sydney LaRue Dwyer. I'm a professional soccer player and a professional mom. <laughs> this is my husband, Dom. He plays professional soccer too. When we got married in 2015, people thought we were crazy. But he's the luckiest guy in the world. This is our two-year-old son, Cassius. He's the light of our lives. The end. Oh. This is Ziggy. He's the most well-behaved member of our family. Yay! Still a girl. And this is our baby girl. She's due this summer. <laughs> it's a hectic life. But to us, it's perfect. Welcome to our chaos. All right, have a seat here, by the way. Well, top. is that a bad all right? That's a good all right. <laughs> She's bad. like, ooh, all right. <laughs> so we start preseason next week, and then I'm going to be like in some of the stuff, obviously, no yeah. like contact or anything too crazy, but I'll do like. Passing patterns and ball work and cool. stuff like that. How much are you running? I'm not like doing a crazy amount. It'll just yeah. be like in drills. I'm not like doing. Yeah, okay. But yeah, my my mom was like, I don't think you should be running. But then I feel like some people run their entire pregnancy. They do. Yeah. yeah. So listen to your body, and then um, if you feel like things are a little too intense, then you can just go down a little bit on the intensity. Yeah. yeah. You know? All right. A little bit of warm gel. Look at her wet. You see her? <laughs> well, hand right up by the mouth now. Her little legs. Mm -hmm. Still a girl. Still a girl. Yeah. <laughs> with Cassius, my pregnancy with him was perfect. I didn't have any issues. I remember I brought my mom and Cassius to the ultrasound and we saw the baby and my mom was like, there it is. I said, there's no heartbeat. And she said, no, I'm sorry. And then we lost the baby. You'll always have these what ifs, like, was it a boy, was it a girl, who were they gonna be? We found out on, on July 4th and she's due on July 4th, so. It's like full circle. It's... Okay, I love you. <laughs> I love you. <laughs> oh, okay. Love you guys. Bye, we'll see you this afternoon. Bye. Okay. All right. I said it was my last one. And. Yeah, it probably needs to be. All my teammates are like, so like, how much longer can you do this for? And I feel like everyone's like, okay, enough. Sometimes we look at a pregnant woman as being sick. I'm like, I feel my strongest when I'm carrying a child. Working out and, and playing gives me this high that can't be attained anywhere else. These are um, from being pregnant. I got this one with Cassius, and this one is from her. They feel like bruises. A good job, Rach. This is my birthing class. Let's go, I'll race all of you. You race me, you can race me, beat me, sit. I'm telling you. Yes, sir, we're ahead of the game. In the meetings in the morning we'll go through what she can and can't do, how we adapt the session to bring her in and we can't do contact. We can't yep. do things where you could get contact with the football. But apart from that, we work a lot of technical work as well. That was for sure my last practice. <laughs> yeah, it's time. I can't like get my hips around the ball. I can feel it in my back. And I'm pretty sure every single time I took a shot, I peed just a little bit. 
I'm done. And I think Billy. I see it. I see it. Yeah, what is it? What is it? got his own personality and his own agenda and he is 100% Cassius. Aww. Say hi doggies. Hi, two, doggies. two doggies. Oh, oh. You need to hear mommy's hand? Come on. You're all right. You were going too fast. Too fast. He's crazy and he's in the best way. We love him for it and I don't ever want to take that away from him. Push mommy one more time. She needs your help. Push. <laughs> Are you okay? Are you okay? When I found out I was pregnant with him, it completely turned my life around. My mom, she sent me this long text message and it was like, you know, maybe that this is the best thing that, that could happen to you. And it absolutely was. 